Hello there global citizens and welcome to yet another intriguing update on the US current state in major minerals and income generation in spite of its financial debt crisis that has been plaguing its economy in the last few months. Could this be a breaking point of recovery for the US economy in 2024 and how much more is the US ready to go to ensure it bounces from its debt crisis amidst the fierce competition from other nations? Sit back and do not move an inch. Relax and watch us take you down this lane in the next couple of minutes. The U.S. economy has documented a striking surge in its precious metals sector. The prices of gold, silver, and copper are touching new highs, compelling investors to deeply explore the realm and bask in the probability of attaining long-term stable profits. The rise in prices of precious metals signals the onset of a changing market narrative, where investors are keen to explore robust investment alternatives as compared to riskier, more volatile ones. This pivot is primarily triggered by the erosion of U.S. economic metrics, the loss of consumer faith in the USD, and inflating debt metrics, which would trigger a potential collapse of the U.S. market and its economic prowess. Gold is currently showing signs of consolidation, signaling a brewing bullish outbreak. The price of gold at press time is sitting at $2,379, up 0.77% in the last 24 hours. Per TradingView's user sentiment index, the tool points towards a strong buy signal, suggesting that investors are keenly exploring gold in all its forms. The new price threshold for gold has been predicted to breach past $2,500, given that it continues to follow its current progressive course. Similarly, the gold price surge has primarily gained momentum due to the demand spurred by global central banks. These global banks are driving the price of gold to touch new highs with a continuous buying spree. The CB quarterly gold consumption has skyrocketed since early 2022. In fact, the People Bank of China PBOC, has now bought gold for a straight 17 months, and the Russian Central Bank will accelerate the buying from this month. The price goes up, so their XX goes up. We can see parabolic moods if the retail crowd in the West also jumps in. Similarly, the price of silver and copper is also touching new price milestones. Per Game of Trades, a notable financial panel on X, silver has broken past a critical price level, which will help its prices skyrocket and establish a new price marker. Also, the price of copper, on the other hand, has also gained momentum, suggesting a new price milestone for the metal to breach and sit at. There are many reasons to be bullish on copper for the long term, and one of them is this structural supply deficit, which, when combined with the lack of exploration and production that we've seen, suggests that prices could appreciate more from here with sufficient demand. One analyst panel of X shared. However, the high prices of silver and copper also signal a looming inflation crisis. Per Vlad Bastian, a notable financial analyst on X, rising copper prices can bring in an economic crisis for technical sectors. This can primarily be triggered by copper's extensive demand aiding the manufacturing sector. High copper prices can signal a slow economic progression, hampering technological and sectoral development in the U.S. Silver is also experiencing a notable price hike into the recent gold rush. The metal has finally broken its consolidation phase, embracing bullish momentum and pace. Silver has long been stuck in a consolidation phase, portraying a reluctant stance on its price threshold. However, with the growing demand and the metal's prestige growing stronger, the price of silver has finally broken past several resistance levels to reach $27.03 at press time. Let's find out why is silver rising. The financial markets around the world are undergoing a dynamic shift. With user sentiment shifting towards accumulating robust metals as a hedge against inflation, the prices of gold and silver are touching new highs. Silver is up $27 an ounce, while gold price sits at the $2,300 threshold. The demand for these metals has grown tremendously as users are now transitioning toward exploring safer asset alternatives to battle the growing inflation woes. Various financial analysts on X have regarded the silver price hike as one of the best developments to note in the domain of finance. This is undoubtedly the best-looking chart I've seen in my career, one of the most important macro developments unfolding as of late. If you ask me, the silver rush is just getting started. Silver has long been propagated as a solid alternative to battle the rising inflationary pressure. The author of Rich Dad, Poor Dad, Robert Kiyosaki, an ardent metal proponent, further shared his theory on how silver and gold are dubbed solid backups to fight inflation and sudden economic pivots. As I warned in Rich Dad, Poor Dad, RTPD, over 27 years ago, savers are losers. The dollar has lost 95% of its purchasing power since 1913, the year that the Federal Reserve System, Fed, and Internal Revenue Service, IRS, were formed. Please wake up and take control of your money and your information. If you trust our political leaders, you are in trouble financially. 
please take control of your financial teachers and your money. I am a hard real money advocate and I only save real gold, silver, and Bitcoin. As investors pivot towards safer hedge options, the demand for silver is also growing at a consistent pace. The growing retail demand for silver is driving its current price rush. According to the Silver Institute, the global demand for silver has grown 18% to 1.12 billion, 2022. Silver, alongside gold, is used heavily in sectors related to jewelry, manufacturing, engineering, and healthcare, which are now inflating its retail demand. The Silver Institute issues a positive forecast for the metal with its demand, touching 1.2 billion ounces in 2024. Thanks for stopping by and hope you enjoyed the video. Do stay tuned for more unrelated videos right here at our channel. Like, share, and subscribe. Goodbye for now.